Different societies regard health issues differently. Somatic societies place emphasis on bodily health and performance. They regard mental functions as secondary or derivative, the outcomes of corporeal processes, healthy mind in a healthy body. Cerebral societies emphasize mental functions over physiological and biochemical processes. They regard corporeal events as secondary or derivative, the outcome of mental processes, mind over matter. Elective societies believe that bodily illnesses are beyond the patient's control. Not so mental health problems. These are actually choices made by the sick. It is up to the afflicted to decide to snap out of their conditions, heal thyself. The locus of control is internal. Providential societies believe that health problems of both kinds, bodily as well as mental, are the outcomes of the intervention or influence of a higher power, God, fate. Thus, diseases carry messages from God and are the expressions of a universal design and a supreme volition. The locus of control is external, and healing depends on supplication, ritual, and magic. Finally, medicalized societies believe that the distinction between physiological disorders and mental ones, dualism, is spurious, is wrong, and is a result of our ignorance. All health-related processes and functions are bodily and are grounded in human biochemistry and genetics. As our knowledge regarding the human body grows, many dysfunctions hitherto considered mental will be reduced to their corporeal components. Examples, schizophrenia and depression.